do three strength training moves combined with three cardio moves for 30 seconds. And before we get started, I want to tell you you're going to need a band or small, uh, some weights and an exercise mat because we're getting down on the floor. Okay, this is an exercise video you can do at home, you can do in the gym, if you're traveling, it's awesome to do in your hotel room. So, first what we're going to do is we're going to be working our legs, then we're going to move on to a back exercise, I mean a chest exercise, and the last one we're going to do is a back exercise. So, we're going to start with 20. It's always a great idea if you can warm up first, so before you start the video, do a couple stretches, warming up, but we are going to get that heart rate going pretty fast. Okay, the first thing we're going to start with is 20 squats with a kick. So, are you ready? I just want to make sure you don't need to go all the way down if you can't. If you need to, just come down to here, whatever works for you, okay? We've got beginning, intermediate, and advanced levels. All right, so here we go. We're going to start with squat and kick. One, two, three, four, that's it, five, six, a nice kick there, seven, eight, you can do it, nine, ten, feel those glutes working, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, almost there, fifteen, sixteen, you got it, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. All right, we're going to move into our 30-second cardio blast. It is a football shuffle. So we're going to start like this and just tapping our feet. If you're beginning, advanced, you're going to really tap them. All right, you ready? Here we go. And tap for 30 seconds. You can do anything for 30 seconds. All right, keep it going. Keep those feet moving. If you need to slow down, slow down. If you can speed up, speed up. You're doing awesome. Keep going. All right, here we go. Keep it moving. 10, 9, 8, 7, come on, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Good job. All right. Now, we're going to work on our chest. Really build up the the powerhouse of the upper body. We're going to do some push-ups. This is where you need your mat. And for beginners, we're going to come down on our knees. And we're going to start. We're going to do 20 push-ups. If you can't do 20, do 10. Whatever works for you. All right? We're going to make sure we have a nice flat back, keeping those abs in. Are you ready? Here we go. One. Two. Three, awesome. Four, five, sucking in that belly. Six, keeping that flat back. Seven, eight, nine, come on, push it, you can do it. Really challenge yourself. Ten, if you're a little more advanced, let's do the last ten here. One, two, three, four, woo, five, Six, seven, come on, a couple more. Eight, we got it. Nine, and ten. Whoa, push ups, one of my favorite exercises. All right, we're going to go back into one of our 30 second cardio moves. We're going to do a skier, which is just jumping from side to side, like you're skiing down that hill. So, again, if you're a beginner, just lightly jump back and forth. If you're advanced, Really give it a hop. Whatever works for you, okay? So you ready? Here we go. 30 seconds. I'm starting out nice and light, keeping a good pace. It's going back and forth. Remember, 30 seconds. You can do anything for 30 seconds. I could have made it a minute, but I didn't. I'm being nice. Get that heart rate up there. Come on. All right, let's speed it up a little. 10, 9, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Whoo, okay. My heart rate is up. How about yours? I know it is. Oh, ponytail's coming out. Okay. The last exercise we're going to do is for our back. This is when you need your bands or your weights. All right, we've got a lot of muscles in our back. Keeps that spine erect. Want to make sure we work them and burn the fat. That's why we're using three of our largest muscles to really burn 
bend over row. So we're going to stand on the band, bend over nicely with a nice flat back, and we're going to squeeze our shoulder blades together and squeeze them together. So let's start there. Ready? We're going to do 20. One, two, three, squeeze in it, four, five, feel it, six, working that back, seven, holding in that stomach, eight, we always want to make sure we're holding in our stomach, nine, ten, halfway there. Make sure during the day you have good posture. You're sitting up straight, you're holding in your abs, You'll be surprised how many of you are slouching when you're sitting, all right? When you're driving in the car. All right, we're going to do three more here. One, squeeze it, really squeeze it at the top. Two, and last one, three. Awesome. All right, I know I say awesome a lot, my favorite word. <laughs> all right, we're going to do our last cardio move. We did skiers, now we're going to do skaters. All right, skaters are just tapping back and forth, putting our leg behind us and tapping the ground. Again, if you're a beginner, just go back and forth. If you're advanced, you can give it a nice little hop. All right, you guys ready? For 30 seconds of skaters, here we go. Just keep it going. We're working the legs, working the glutes, getting that cardio up there. All right, come on. I'm going to add in a little hop here, really challenge myself. Whatever you need to do to get through this workout, you can do it. we got 10 more seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, come on, 4, 3, 2, and 1. You did it. Okay. That was one set. I want you to go back and do that. Two more times, that'll be three sets. That is a great exercise to start your day. Maybe you come home from work, whatever you can fit it in your schedule. I'm out of breath here, it's working. But you need to make time to exercise, to fit it in your day. So, I will see you guys again soon. I hope you enjoyed the exercise routine. Laura London, see you again, bye-bye.